Assalamu alaikum everyone, I am Fariha and today I am going to show you how to create a map layout in Arc Map. First of all, go to Windows, select Catalog, find out the folder where you saved your all shape file, click on the shape file and drag it over layer panel. This is my polygon shape file. I also want my streamline shape file. Just drag it to the layer panel. Set this on the top. Now streamline is visible. I also create circle shape line for indicating district headquarter. Drag it to the top. Now point shape file is also visible. Right click on shape file and select zoom to layer. Right click on shape file, go to properties. Select font size 10 pixel. Hit OK. Again right click on shape file and select label features. Now label is visible. Again right click on shape file, go to properties. Click on symbology option, then categories. Then hit uh, add all values button, press OK change the shape file id right click on it go to properties here change value field to area in symbology add all values select ok to change a streamline color double click on straight line select river change width increase width then hit ok then go to circle shape, double click on it. Reduce size to 8 pixel and hit OK. To create map layout, first of all, go to the bottom. There you will find layout view. Click on it. You can just go to zoom in option. And to position your map, go to this pan tool. Then go to insert option, select legend, select shape file in both uh, map layers and uh, legend items box. I want one column, then click next. You can change the legend title color, font size and alignment also. Here you can change the other uh, legend items like streamline. Here I select streamline and uh, select S curve symbol, water body is area. Then click on next and finish. Position this, then resize it. Zoom in this artboard, just go to zoom to percent. 
option and select 75%. Position map again by pen two. Go to select element. Here I want to uh, delete the unnecessary legend. To do so, right click on it, select convert to graphics. Now again right click on it, select ungroup. Now click on the outside, then select unnecessary legend and press delete. Zoom, zoom out your map to 75%. Right click on it and select group again. Then again go to zoom to percent, select 50 percent, go to insert, select title, position title, Again insert, select north, north arrow, I select this one and hit ok. Change the font size of the title into 4 pixel and bold. Change the font name. Monsidat semi bold. Again go to insert, select scale bar, I select this one and click OK.
position this you can change the unit just right click on it go to properties here change the division unit meter or kilometer kilometer number you can also change the number of division and subdivision I position my title at the bottom. Again go to insert, select data frame, resize it, position it at the top left corner. I want to add Bangladeshi map in this new data frame therefore I go to connect to folder I want to connect the folder where I saved Bangladeshi map to add new data you can go to catalog connect the folder then uh, find the shape file and, and drag your shape file to the new data frame or, or you can select your shape file and drag it to the arc map. Then select shape file from layers and copy it, paste it in new data frame. To clear level, right click on it. unchecked label features if you want to show same color right click on shape file go to properties go to symbolosy Select remove all and then press OK. Set the outline color no color. And press OK. This is the area of this shape file.
I expand the boundary a little bit. Now I want to add latitude and longitude in this map layout. To do that, right click on your map, go to properties, select grids tab, then click on new grid. Check first option, then click on next, select labels only in appearance, then click next finish then go to properties again exist in exist tab i want to display ticks inside in labels tab i change font name monsira Increase font size, 16 pixel. Change label offset. Check left and right in label orientation. Go to intervals tab. I input 5 minute, 30 second in both x axis and y axis interval click on apply then ok again click on apply and ok zoom out a little bit this is our final result i want to export this map as image go to file Click on export map, rename it, click on save, now open image. You can print this map now. That's all for today. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and thumbs up. Thanks for watching.